Welcome to the Institute of Navigation 4th Annual Autonomous Snowplow Competition. Made possible by the Institute of Navigation Satellite Division with additional funding and volunteer support from leading corporations. This competition promotes student research and development of navigation and control systems by challenging teams to build a robot to clear a path of snow with no human intervention. Three, two, one, let's plow. Some of the top engineering, mathematics, and science scholars from universities across the Upper Midwest participate in this four-day event. First place wins $7,000 this year, with $4,000 going to second and $2,000 to third. Uh, I learned how to use a totally new operating system, Fedora Linux, that will easily interface with, with our camera, with our uh, motor controller and with the Xbox controller as well. Drivers up. Localization up. Autonomy ready. This is ready we're going to be. Here we go. Oh! It's going to go backwards the whole way. It's on, is it on go? Ah! Oh. And, and you'll be the you'll be the e staff guy too. Don't yep. stop unless the whole team has said stop. Whenever you're ready. I'm ready. And now, now. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Oh come on! Did it hit? E stop. No, it didn't hit the blue one. Before any plowing begins, a panel of industry professionals judge each team as they formally present their snowplow design, including navigation and guidance control systems, software and cost analysis for commercialization to the general public. We were going for the low cost approach, uh, something you might be able to build in your backyard. Our robot runs off of a webcam. Uh, the webcam goes into a Raspberry Pi. We're trying to focus on keeping costs low, so Raspberry Pi is ru only running about $45. And then this year, then added uh, difficulty of trying to avoid a pole in the middle of the, of the plowing field. We had to try to avoid that instead of just going straight through in the past. The pride and joy of this robot here is this laser rangefinder that we got in the front. It's uh, similar to what they use in surveying, updates 25 times a second, whereas other teams are using ones that update about five times a second. So our cost is a little bit higher. Okay, good. Let's move. Yeah. Right, yep. Let's go. Last year we had a two-wheel system. This year we upgraded to four-wheel drive, uh, which is going to help us with lateral traction. We had to uh, upgrade it to a solid-state drive from last year because the uh, normal hard drives will freeze in this cold Minnesota uh, temperatures. This robot didn't happen overnight. We've been working on it for uh, this is the sixth generation, and this is uh, two years in the two and a half years in the making for this iteration of the robot. The Institute of Navigation is extremely proud of the talent and advances shown in this fourth annual competition. Congratulations to all the teams and thank you for your courageous efforts. Thank you sponsors and volunteers. Your help makes this competition possible. Thanks everyone. Thanks officers. Thanks judges. Thanks everybody. You guys are great. <laughs>